We are just a few days away from one of the largest displays of art and competition in our region. Artist Fear starts Friday in downtown Greenville, and Christine Scarpelli has already got the, the food covered. What are you What are you in the middle of now? So remember last time I told you, like, guys, there was a hot option, a little bit of a spicy option on some of the food we were making. Well, all of this you can see for yourself live and in person this weekend at Artisphere. The fabulous students with Greenville County School District, all of the career centers. We've got you guys here at the Golden Strip Career Center. We've got Bonds, Ennery, and Donaldson as well. You're going to be competing against other restaurants. Very exciting. The spicy option, the darker one. Doesn't that look incredible? Uh, Sierra, what are we looking at here? What is this stuff? Oh, this is the elote, which is the Mexican street corn, which is served on a skewer, and it's dusted with ricotta cheese and a spicy mayo. And you don't have to get the really spicy one, right? No. You don't have it's to. It's an option. Aha, very good. But I keep calling this elote, but it sort of is, right? The corn is also, it's kind of like that, but this is deconstructed? Yes. Awesome. Uh, what, how is that different? Is it a little bit less spicy in some ways? It's less spicy and, you know, you get some of that flavor that you get from the elote here on the deconstructed side. Mm -hmm. The cheese isn't on top like the elote, it's on the oh. side. Diet friendly maybe, dairy free. <laughs> and, and that's one of the things, you know, Cheffy, we were talking about, there's so many different um, I don't know if intolerances or allergies or things you're worried about, but you guys are really making this accessible for a lot of people. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you, you got to think, being the culinary program, we hit on all of it, dietitian, nutrition side of things. And uh, to be able to say that everything that we're going to bring has either a gluten-free option or is gluten-free, uh, I feel like really hits on uh, what's going wow. on right now. A lot of people, you know, going the gluten-free route and people with celiac. So, like, uh, I'd love to say that we, we can serve all um, all nutrition and diet needs. Good. This weekend. Now I want to hear it you guys this is your last opportunity telling people should they come? Why should they come? Lissandra, why should people come this weekend? You know it's just a fun event. You know you get to taste amazing food. You get to taste our food that's right here. Uh-huh. That's incredible. Smells great. It smells great. The smells and then you're really supporting students would you say? It comes directly back to the program guys. So all the money that we'll make this weekend uh, you know we'll split with all the career centers and then it goes right back into our program so we can keep stuff like this. Wow, again and again. You guys plan to compete oh, if absolutely. it continues? Oh. Oh, ho, ho. All right. Hey, the best in show last year. They're looking for another one, guys. What do you think? You going to visit them? Artist here this weekend? Yeah, that sounds like a great thing. Sounds delicious. Mm -hmm. My goodness. Very much so. We All will right. track down that booth. Thanks, Christine. <laughs> good. It is 846.